The overall goal of this procedure is to detect functional matrix metalloproteinases. This is achieved by first preparing the sample for zymography by adding a loading buffer free of reducing agent. A gelatin zymogram gel is then loaded with the sample and allowed to run until the tracking dye reaches the end of the gel. Following electrophoresis, the gel is renatured, developed, stained, and destained. The final step of the procedure is to scan the gel for data analysis. Ultimately, results can be obtained that show the activity of matrix metalloproteinases in the samples through band density analysis. Hi, I'm Xu Yihu from the laboratory of Dr. Christine Beaton in the Department of Molecular Physiology and Biophysics at the Baylor College of Medicine. Today, we will show you a procedure for detecting matrix metalloproteinases by zymography. We use this procedure in our laboratory to study matrix metalloproteinases secreted by cultured primary cell. So, let's get started. Prior to the start of this protocol, prepare all matrix metalloproteinases, or MMPs, adequately to maintain the function of the enzymes. The samples can be used immediately or stored at minus 80 degrees Celsius. Here, MMP2, also known as gelatinase A or type 4 collagenase, is used to demonstrate visualization of MMP activity with zymography. Once MMP enzymes have been prepared, obtain a 10% gelatin zymogram gel.